Hi guys, I hope you're having a good week so far. So uh, tomorrow is a very special holiday, it's St. Patrick's Day. And I have included two videos for you. One of them is of a famous dance performance that some of you might be familiar with, but I'm just bringing it back up. It's uh, highlighting a very special form of dance called river dance. And they use, yes, tap shoes. And I, I know that a couple of you are familiar with that as well. So what we do, uh, you watch that video. And then the second video is more about Irish music in general. So just please watch that and give me a response uh, of one, what you thought of the performance, something specific like, I really like how uniform they are, or I, I love how energetic they are, or I think the lead dancer is very pretty, or the lead dancer is very handsome. Something very specific to let me know that you watched it. And then the second video, something that you learned about Irish music in general. Um, and then I want to make sure that we're still continuing our practice of the ukulele this week. So uh, reviewing the body parts, also reviewing the names of the strings. And remember, when you're looking at the screen, you shouldn't be mirroring me. You should be doing the opposite way so that the head of the, the, head of the uh, ukulele always points left, okay? Um, and we also talked about our new chord, C, where we're using, if you're in third grade, we're using this finger, the fourth finger, or your th third finger in ukulele. We put it on the bottom string in the third fret. C. Hot cross buns, hot cross buns, one a penny, two a penny, hot cross buns. That should have been recorded this week or this past week. If not, continue it on and practice it this week. If you're in first grade, we're using our first finger like that, hot cross buns, and so on and so forth. So just practice those this week. We'll add a new chord next week, but I do want to see that you have at least the C down before we move on, okay? If you have any questions, let me know. Short time with me today, but uh, a lot of time to watch and respond to the videos that I've included and lots of time to practice this week. I'll see you later. I'll see you later.